the MIS budget is up uh, a little over five thousand dollars I will point out that uh, last year it was cut by about twelve thousand dollars twelve thousand nine hundred and twenty dollars by the budget committee so it's still it's up a little but it's still down from what it has been in the past I worked really hard on this budget this year I have added a section called computer support everything used to just kind of be lumped under supplies and expenses but I didn't feel that uh, if when you look at your detail you'll see a lot um, under computer support you see all of like the licensing renewals and items like that so I felt that it was better um, if it was pulled out of supplies and expenses because I don't really consider that a supplier um, and put into its own account and I did something similar to what the police department does because they have their own IT department they're the only um, department outside of that doesn't isn't supported by the IT department the two gentlemen that work for me and I also so basically I just went through here you'll see increases and decreases overall it is a 2.36 percent increase which is not very large I don't feel like it is but we have really spent some significant time kind of just reallocating money and putting things where it's properly spent and looking at exactly how many uh, hard drives they're buying a year and um, we even went so far as to look at our computer which everyone was always just given a basic computer in the past because they were under the impression that's all that they could afford so we I've sat down with them we've come up with different categories so we have three different categories of computer users so to speak um, and we've priced out computers that go with each of the categories we've looked at who needs to be replaced I think it's 17 computers next year that we're looking to replace and we looked at them and put them into the proper categories and stuff so we've spent a lot of uh, Paul Dillon and myself have spent a lot of time and Jamie has also spent time with me really kind of dissecting this budget and trying to figure out where the money's being spent what is it being spent on and how can we improve workstations uh, for certain users in this town and so um, we broke it into those three different categories and we have all kinds of pretty charts over here and stuff and making sure that they're getting uh, the resources that they need to do their job and stuff so this year we're on track we have already ordered 10 of our replacement computers and I think we're looking to order another 10 or 15 I believe so that we can get all of them replaced in 16 that are supposed to be replaced so we can be right on schedule going forward because they always seem to be behind and we're I'm trying hard to get them in line and have all the computers up to the uh, standards of the users 365 is not in here I know that's a topic that came up last year it has to do with the cloud and the email system um, we are working on receiving quotes for that and we figure since it tends to be a controversial issue we will put it through as a warrant article I believe once we have all of the information that we need in regards to pricing for that and we'll push it forward and hope it to get it passed as a warrant article so that's the MIS department any questions on MIS Phil negative sir Rick thank you Jim Lead yet not it done on the uh, on the MIS did somebody We're, look at it from outside yes and do you have a report on that yet or no? We do not have the full report yet. Okay, so, so me, 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 but they did tell us our ge the gentlemen who do the job down there do an excellent job. Okay, so, so we I have mean, that much. I mean, you you are looking at Absolutely. all aspects of the MIS and whether we're using the appropriate software, whether we're doing the appropriate thing, and where we should be moving forward with it. Right. Yeah, I think we are doing need, all of that. Need to know that, that that you're on top of the situation with Paul and Dylan. Yep. And Jamie. And Jamie, yes. 